The following is a short tutorial on how to create a shortcut on your desktop so that you can get to D2L quicker. So to start on an iPhone you're going to go to Safari. Once you're in Safari you're going to look up the URL. So the URL for our board is dsbn.elearningontario.ca so you're going to search that. Then you're going to get as close to the login page as possible so you're going to see that's where I am right now. And what you're going to do is right at the bottom of the page, there's a rectangle with an arrow coming out of it. You're going to click on that button, and when you do, you're going to see so there's some options. Well, one of those options right at the bottom with the plus mark is Add to Home Screen. So what this button does is adds what appears to look like an app to your home screen, but just links you directly to that website. So we're going to call this D2L, and I'm going to add it. Now you're going to see that it shows up on my desktop right here near the bottom uh, called D2L. Remember if you hold it down you can slide it and you can put it on whatever page you want or at the bottom. I'm just going to put it right here. Now here's another nice little trick if you want to make it even quicker. You can go to settings and in the settings what you're looking is scrolling down to see Safari. Once you open that you're going to go under general and you're going to click on autofill. So inside of Autofill, they have a names and passwords, and you can see that mine is on. The reason that's on is because I like it to fill in my usernames and passwords, so I don't have to log them in. It just makes it quicker. So when I click on D2L, you're going to see that my username and password is automatically filled in. If I was to click on that, I could switch usernames and passwords if I click on the password button. But I'm just going to one-click it, and now I'm in. So now the experience to get on the device is really quick and easy. You can just put that shortcut to your desktop, have it autofill the password, and then you're in. And because D2L is responsive now, it will look great on all devices, and you'll get there really quickly. You can also do this on Android when you're in Chrome. You just click on the three dots in the top right corner and there's a button that says add to your home screen and Android naturally fills your usernames and passwords in. So it'll be a really fast way to get there. Um, hopefully this was helpful for you and you're able to get onto your D2L nice and fast. It will almost feel like it's an app, but one thing nice about this is that you do not need updated iOSs. You're not going to run into that issue of having to update your app and it not working on certain devices. This will work on any device that has internet and it will be a great experience. Thank you for watching this short tutorial.